Hey guys, and welcome to Extreme Hotel Makeover. Or rather, uh, Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. And we are still in inside the Hollowbrook Hotel, which is infested with Sabat cronies who want to kill the crap out of me. And eyeless dudes who just seem to have accepted their fate. Totally worth it. Oh, he's still alive. He was still very alive. Well. You know, it's really funny. Reloading this game seems to make it where people just don't care about me anymore. I do not understand. I'm just going to keep blood healing until I get all the way to the top. And then, and I really don't understand why sometimes Blood Heal does a lot, and then other times it does, like, nothing. I, I don't understand this game at all. I know there's more bad guys in there, but I, I don't know. All right, whatever. Heal some aggravated damage. Sweet. All right. Um, I don't remember where to go. I know that it isn't this. What? Oh, okay. Cool. All right. Fine enough. Ow. Grumpy old man looking jerk. So, that is something that I can talk about. I'm actually going to try real hard to cut down on the swearing uh, in this YouTube channel. It's still going to happen occasionally, and it's not for the reason that many, many people are. It's not because of YouTube censorship. I mean, I could lose monetization on all of my videos, and absolutely nothing would change. I'm doing it because one of the... I don't know, number one people that watches my videos is uh, my friend Brian Novak. And Brian Novak doesn't really curse. I mean, he probably does sometimes, I mean, but he has no reason to do it in his daily life. And in his Let's Plays that he does, that I really enjoy, um, even when he's playing more adult games, like I think he played um, Blood Dragon not too long ago, he still didn't have to, you know, kind of resort to cursing just to provide content for his channel. He came up with smarter things to say, wittier or more entertaining in their own right. And so, I mean, I still kind of have the habit, so it's going to happen. And I'm not censoring myself for YouTube. I'm censoring myself for friendship because, honestly, I could be a better a better commentator if I thought about what I was going to say rather than just spat out the first expletive that comes to mind. I This was also driven by me going back and watching some of my early videos, and I was pretty bad. Um, I, 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 I'm not particularly happy with all of that, so we'll see. I mean, it just makes me sound childish and less intelligent, so there's really not any good reason for it. Although, that particular scenario right there leaves a little bit of profanity that I might want to use, because that's pretty ridiculous over there. Also, why does blood healing just not work? Sometimes it just doesn't work. See there, I just burned all my blood accidentally. That was not what I meant to do. Um, let's see, I'm going to... Yeah, all right, I'm going to sneak closer, and then I will empty my bullets into those gentlemen, and we'll have a much better time fighting them. Except that I can't go through that large hole that just happens to be there. Can I go through here at all? I guess I'm not allowed. I'm supposed to go through the hotel in the order they want me to go through. And nothing else. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, God, just 
Jump and reload. Yeah, I didn't think that was gonna go well either. <sighs> All right, um, let's see. New strategy. Because I'm kind of limited on ammo and I'm kind of stranded in the middle of this place, I am going to do this. And that really didn't help me any. I am going to use my weaker guns whenever I'm fighting the ghoul people, the ones that don't explode in giant bloody blobs. Like, this dude is actually a werewolf, so I should actually use the flamethrower on him. And then while he is flaming, I will put him out with a torrent of bullets. All right, so that guy is a ghoul. So, like, it's the hoodie ghouls, the hoodie ninjas are, are ghouls and See, and they they aren't they aren't that that good. It's the guys with all the magic powers that make things kind of rough. All right, so I'm gonna. I'm actually, since I'm not aggravated, I'm gonna leave this guy completely alone, and I'm gonna go back this way. Uh -oh. Not going well. All right, just keep just keep reloading. Okay. Getting there. Man, vampires are relatively bullet soluble. There we go. All right, so now that I'm both out of blood and health, I'm gonna go use that ghoul. Well, I'm gonna miss beating on him, even though he's just standing there. No, 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 crap. Oh, we had a deal that I wasn't supposed to do that. All right, well, now I have to avenge him. BRB, reloading. All right, um, so I've got 14 shots left for that. So that, that went well, that got me all the way through this area. But I'm gonna take that guy out too. Hold on, crossbow time. That time I actually hit him. Really just this gun. My uh, hunter slayer SMG leaves a lot to be desired. All right, let's use this. I'm trying to think if the problem is for close range, this thing sucks so bad. So I gotta kind of be prepared. Okay, well, you know what? Being prepared never helped. Five bullets. Just shoot you five times. There's a dude that's going to break through the door. I can see him now. Okay, I've got two ghouls left or a vampire and a ghoul. Did they just close the door again? Did they just send one guy out and then close the door? That is awesome. Uh, okay. Uh, boop. They are, in fact, sending them out one at a time. Okay, hold on. Darn it. I left a sizable hole in their kitchen counter, but didn't actually do any damage. Being unable to unscope while reloading is a 
really frustrating thing. All right. We'll do this the hard way. I hope you guys are fans of really blurry gameplay footage because that is what you are getting. One bullet left. Six in this gun. I really just have to go resort to the shotgun. It's it's all I have left. Well, I mean, it's possible. <laughs> uh, go. What? What? Where did you guys come from? Were you guys just hiding there the whole time while I slowly killed your friends? That is ridiculous. I don't even know what to do, man. I don't even need to go in there. That's not even a real way. Psych, it is totally a real way because the enemies just come out of there when I avoid them. Alright, come here. Come here, bats. Uh-oh. Not doing well. Well. <laughs> I guess, I mean... <laughs> I don't really... I don't think I'm gonna make it, guys. Not this time, anyway. Just lend me your secrets. No! I did it again. I wasn't paying attention. I was watching my aggravated damage go down to see how close I could get it, and I did not... Didn't do it. I just didn't do the right thing. All right, so this door was supposed to break. All right. So you're just right here. Actually, it wasn't terrible. That guy. Okay. See the 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 Ingram, the Mac Ten, or whatever. Yeah, this gun over here is basically the equivalent of spitting at me. It really doesn't hurt that much. This pistol, however... Bleep! Does do quite a bit of damage. Okay, so there's a dude. Yeah, come here. Don't do the, don't do the jump attack. Never, ever do the jump attack. I don't think I've ever mentioned it, but I really like how all of the melee combat in this game sounds like you're bouncing off their weapon. You know, it's all metal on metal sounds all the time. What? Oh, from over there. Okay. Um, hmm. Since I can't get over there, it might actually be worthwhile for me to shoot these guys this way. Although, no, I'm going to save that. I'm going to try to kill them with this thing. Are they retreated? Well, all right. So we've had a, re a relatively unsuccessful time here, and I'm not quite willing to go and get out Lincoln Park again. Although, although, it would not be a terrible idea. I'm just going to use my sword through this entire first part, see if I can get by. This guy is the problem, though. He is the gatekeeper of a good run or not. So far, not so great. But that's okay. And see, I just turned on healing there, and my health did not move one tiny bit. 
Like, I don't understand how this works. Does it, like, have a compounding effect where, like, I have to click it twice to get anything out of it or what? I don't know, man. I don't know. No, I don't know. <laughs> and I don't even feel bad taking all of this guy's blood. All right, that is a pretty large thing to figure out. Hey, you, come here. Dude, just, just, just let me do it. This is gonna, this is gonna end poorly for you either way. What up, guys? Yep. All right. You guys still over there? Yeah, one of you is. <laughs> That's rude. Okay, don't just go look at the... Don't just go look at where I shot and missed. Also, what the heck did I just hit? Okay, that one was me. Okay, so that's two that I feel pretty good about missing. And th that one was... I don't know. I don't know what is happening with this. I just can't do it anymore. It's not a pro. Okay, we got two shots left. There's, there he is. All right, so let's just stand out in the open. Okay, I shot him. Alright. <laughs> Very unfortunate. That whole... I don't know what I expected to happen. Oops. You know what would be really great? If I could not accidentally kill the guy I wanted to feed on. Uh, okay. This has been a relatively standard episode. Just fight things over and over until you finally get out. Oh, golly. All right, um, sword. Don't fight the glowy ones. Come on, just keep doing the spin. Just keep doing the somersault attack, not the not the flip attack. All right, here we go. Okay. Then let's go over here. Sometime today, maybe? No. All right. I'll just go feed on this guy instead. If I can get over these coffins. Just feed on you. Good enough. All right. You know, it's actually a really interesting point. Um, I just saw that Pop prompt to, like, take his gun, and I'm thinking that lots of people use their use these weapons in this area so that I could actually pick up ammo for it and maybe have something better at a later date. What up, dude? Come on. Focus on the murderous guy with claws. I'll just fight you. And I'll try to use you to heal up. Neat. You know, every time, every time I feed in this game, 
I think of that cutscene from Hackers at the end where they're all typing and the camera just keeps rotating around the phone booth. I don't know why I always think of that, but I totally always do. Rifle. They're gone. He is not gone. Sword. Here we go. <laughs> Knock over your friends like bowling pins. Oh gosh. Deal with the guy with the Yeah, deal with the guy with claws first. Nice. No! I could have healed you. Or could have yeah, I could have healed you. I could have saved you. No, I could have used you to heal myself, but whatever. Guess that guy will have to do. Oh, is this a lock pickable door? Quest content? We haven't had quest content in this game. Oh. I'm just... Oh, what's up, dude? All right, buddy. I'm going to just borrow you for a minute. Delightful. Right, we're going to do everything in our power to leave this guy alive. There we go. Perfect. He didn't heal any of our aggravated damage because we had other damage first. But... <sighs> All right. And I'm going to save here because I, I'm done. I don't want to go through this anymore. <laughs> I'm just going to save scum my way through. Eventually build it up to the point. Oh, that, oh hey, hey, buddy. Stop. 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 He's shooting me. You too. Stop. I like how you got kind of slightly upset when I shot him, but not really. Like, you don't even, you're not even care that I'm here. Three, four, five. Oops. Must have hit him in the head or something, because he did not need that extra bullet. All right, we got just enough bullets. Let's go. Beautiful. Assault rifle ammo. Shotguns all over. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'll put the fire out. I'm sorry, I'll put your fire out. It'll be fine. I'll put it out. Oh, it was too late. I tried. Oh, come on. I'm so about to die. Just gonna chill here and hope that guy doesn't suddenly notice me. Please work healing. Just, 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 I'll just vent all my blood. There. Why? Why does healing suck so much? I never had this problem when I wasn't fighting all the time. Wait, I need my sword. Just in case things go real bad here. All right, here we go, here we go. He's got a pistol. Okay. Hey, 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 no. Come back, come back, come back, come back. Buddy, buddy. Thank you. More dudes. At least you guys found someone to talk to. Alright, there we go. I'll leave you plenty coherent and then i will also feed from you. oops feed from you get the rest of my blood back just a little bit though i'm gonna leave you with more blood you can take care of your friend over there there you blind dudes have to stick together that's just this room okay so this elevator looks promising i'm gonna go that way but first i'm gonna save because i am save scumming scum I'm save scum 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 I you know it doesn't matter we're not doing any more of this we're not redoing any more content we're done Here we go zigzag zigzag serpentine All right, I just had to double check um, and make sure that this was a way that I could go. 
Alright, nice. And apparently my healing is working. At least to some degree. So let's let's take stock of our situation here. Desert Eagle, one bullet. Assault rifle. One clip. Not too bad. Whole ton of shotgun ammo. Whole bunch of Glock ammo that I hope that we don't have to resort to using because his gun is kind of weak. Um, and our good old-fashioned Hunter Slayer SMG that just is terrible in every regard. All right, so we're pretty good. Let's drop down. Um, no? Oh, oh, I see. We're supposed to go here. Okay. Elevator's kind of not great. Okay, dude I can heal from. Dangerous guy. Sword, 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 sword. There we go. Well, that worked out really well. So now I'm going to just feed on you. Maybe. Yeah, I am. Even though we're both floating in midair. Oops, I really didn't have to leave you with any blood. That's kind of just a... Yeah, you're just going to keep fighting, even though... Alright, um... Okay, oh. What is... Ooh. I don't know what that does, but it doesn't seem good. Can I kill the... Oh, I know what it is. It's this shotgun guy's scary aura making this guy stronger. Knocking around on it. I'm so sorry. Oh, no. <sighs> they made me do this. Those bastards. Where am I? Behind the bar? This is a weird hotel. This is a weird place. So, like, where do we go from here? I mean, that's up. Call elevator. <laughs> nothing happening there. All right, so here... Got a whole lot of nothing. All right, so there's the bar. There's no doors for them to burst out from. I, I think maybe maybe I'm able to climb up here and, yeah, crawl out. Even though I wasn't before, I can do it here. This is a boss fight. A boss fight. That or they have more of those lovely lady character models that they want me to fight. I'm not quite sure. Nope, what's up? Oh yeah, you look like the even emo yester than everybody else. Also, that's not great. Why is fire everywhere? Why? What is your superpower? Oh, oh, okay. Sure, so... There, now I can hurt you. Now I can miss you. Three more shots left. Never mind. Um. Okay, so the fire spouts obviously hurt. That is very true. Okay. Sure. I mean, I'm following. Is your shield going to go down anytime now? It always boils down to this, doesn't it, boys and girls? It always boils down to this. Why is it always me hiding behind furniture, shooting one tiny bullet at a time? <sighs> well. No more Mr. Firebender? I'm trying to think. I guess he could be like a, a chaotic Tremere. Um, so the Tremere are the Blood Mages that we've had like a little bit of dealings with, but not much because our clan isn't that. But they have the ability to, like, create fire and throw magical demon fire that hurts people. But 
normally they're not aligned with the Sabbat. Normally their secrets are just kind of their own and they just kind of hang out in their own places and do their own things. So, I don't know. Um, but you know what? I'm looking at the time and I think this is a really good place to end this episode. We did defeat a moderately boss-like character. So I'm just going to hang out with this guy for a while and I will see you all next time.